so welcome to the University of Greenwich. My name is Charlie Pilbin Bailey and I am the programme leader for Forensics here. So I want to talk to you about our new programme which is Forensic and Digital Investigation. Now this means you get the key expertise from two different subject specialists. So you get from our forensics team down here at Medway who will teach you more about the crime scene related work and laboratory work and then you get the digital expertise from our Greenwich team who have a wealth of experience in digital investigation, so looking at things like embedded images, steganographic techniques, so learning how you can manipulate digital data to find out where these items have come from. This is hugely important in terms of your skills because it impacts on so many different areas of everyday life from the general public, who is who we serve as forensic scientists. So this covers everything from um, if you are using your phone for instant banking or if you are using RFID chips in your contactless card payments. So these are areas where people's identities may potentially be stolen. Digital investigation links into all areas of police and criminal investigations, so including forensic investigations linked to missing persons, it links to um, the black market, it li links to fraudulent transactions. So there are so many areas in which we are so heavily reliant as a society on digital data that it becomes a priority for us as forensic scientists to investigate those areas and look at also prevention methods. This is hugely important for us and it's hugely important to the general public that we do everything that we can to try and find a resolution for this. So here at Greenwich we work with you as part of your personal tutors, so the idea is almost like a mentor. It means that if you're having a rough day you can come and talk to us. Um, and it doesn't have to just be about your studies, it can also be about anything else that's going on. But the idea is that you can chat to us and we'll help you through those hurdles. As part of your digital and forensic investigation, you will be looking at all sorts of different areas so you will need to use specialist um, equipment when you are taking this data so what you will learn as part of a forensic scientist is that when it comes to digital data you don't work off the originals because as soon as you start manipulating them you are changing them 